Good morning. This tan is still hanging around nicely. <laughs> my face is, I'm gonna to have to shave my beard because this, this tash is getting a bit chubby. This morning I had these really nice pancakes. They are called, where are my cupboard? Take away every day. Really, really nice pancakes, actually. Um, the protein works are excellent. They have slightly better, the protein works have slightly better macros in terms of the lower in calories. Uh, and then carbs. These ones have slightly higher carbs, still really low in fat, really high in protein, but actually tasted a lot nicer, really nice actually. Uh, fluffy, light, yeah, just just a, a little bit more pancake-ish. The protein works are a bit drier. These ones were actually really, really fluffy and nice. The total calories for that meal was about 589, so I think it's a little bit more than the protein works ones, but I think the taste was Delicious. So very, 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 very good and well worth a try. I think they were the maple syrup ones. I have some buttermilk low carb ones as well in the cupboard, which I might try tomorrow. Right now I am off to the gym. Tom's going to take care of the Akado order that's getting delivered very, very shortly. First squat session or leg session for a little bit. Uh, weight this morning was 75.3. So that's the lowest weigh-in I've had pre-carb up comp thing. So 75.3 this morning, that should see a low average based on all the weigh-ins I've had, even from since the comp. So I'm pretty pleased, on track, uh, heavy legs day yesterday, just because I think getting back onto the diet properly, but it is what it is. Anyway, off to the gym, get my squats, deadlifts, some leg press, some hamstring curls and some calves done. That was a nice mega lunch. Oh, those Marks and Spencer's meals are literally the best thing ever. And I had, I got those Fanta Zeros, which are very, very nice as well. Nice alternative to Pepsi Max. Uh, I had the Slim Noodles. I also had a little bit of Cavallo Nero uh, kale stuff. I also had a new carrot and parsnip mash. The one that I have is nice. It's really low in calorie, 112 calories for I think the whole 400 odd grams. But it's okay, it's kind of eating it. But I find this other one, it has a little bit of butter to it and it's a little bit higher in calories, but half of it is still decent amount of volume and it tastes way better. I got that one from Waitrose. So that was very, very nice. This morning and I went to the gym, got that done. I got my squats done. Those were 160 kilos for three sets of seven. And then I went on to some deadlifts. That was a four repper and two three repers. Simply at 190 kilos, simply based on the fact that I didn't have chalk or grip with me. So it was all over the place. And then I did some 400 kilo leg press, three times 10, seated hamstring curl, 70 kilos, three times 10, and then a little bit of calves. Today felt actually amazing. Really, really nice, really easy. Well, I wouldn't say eat, let's not say easy, but it felt better. The past sort of two, three weeks of leg training has been an absolute drag. And I think last week's kind of mini diet break in that I had a refeed, and also the fact that it was a kind of a mini deload based off of the back, back of the fact that I didn't train as much legs or as much as I normally would or the same intensity. So it was actually the best leg session I've had in a long, long time. So that was, that was actually really nice. And I've also got a bit of a sort of skip in my step. Competition one is done. I know what I need to do. I know I'm good enough. I know my condition is on point and I'm motivated to keep pushing to try and get it a little bit better. Like I said earlier, my weight is the lowest it's been uh, apart from sort of show day. So I'm excited. This afternoon, I'm gonna bash through some emails, get some programs done, get all that stuff done, get some vlogs edited. And then I've got to head into London. I've got clients from 5.30 until 8.30. And yeah, busy, busy. Now off into London town. I have two, just like I said, I had two clients, I've got two clients tonight. 
got a call at five o'clock and we'll try and squeeze in another call as well later on. Food prep and everything done, feel very organized today. Uh, still a little bit behind on work, catching up after the weekend sort of shenanigans on stage. I'm also trying to exfoliate and moisturize as best I can with this tan. I booked my tan as well for the next competition. I'm gonna get one on the day at the show. There's like a tanning setup thing, it's called A1 tanning, so that's been recommended, so I'm gonna go with that. And just organizing my week this week in terms of training as well, because obviously I have to fit things in, sorry to the loud. I have to fit things in around this week for next week, because I also have to peak again next week. So I'm training, train lower body today, and then I'm off tomorrow. I'm gonna to train upper body on Thursday, Friday will be lower body again, then shoulders and arms Saturday. Sunday I'm going to take off, and then it's my last leg training session again on Monday or Tuesday. I'll, uh, I'll decide probably later. Apart from that, off to catch the train now, get my steps up walking up from Cannon Street. I'm also going to go to Marks and Spencer's and grab some more of those three for ten pound deals because I really like them and I'm going to get one for Laura as well. And that's it. Work time. So managed to get all my juicy goodies from Marks and Sparks. They are very good. A bit expensive, it's like 30 quid for all that, but it just tastes nice. And I don't go out for dinners very often, and I'm probably not gonna go out for a while, so it makes it much nicer. Just had a coffee at Starbucks, a little iced Americano, tiny little bit of milk, and some caramel sugar-free syrup. I've got a call at five o'clock, so I'm gonna head in have a little uh, carb killer bar, fudge brownie, fiber one thing, and some melon. And then tonight I've got some oppo, oh, the protein mug cake. So I'll, uh, I'll do a little thing on video on that. That right there had to be the best macro filler I've ever come up with. So I had a chocolate fudge protein works mug cake. So that's 150 calories, 20 odd grams of protein, low fat, low carb, coupled with half a tub of Oppo ice cream. You've had Oppo before, I've talked about it in the vlogs, really low calorie ice cream, and then some sugar-free syrup drilled on top. Excuse me. And that consisted of just above 300 calories for all that. Absolutely unbelievable. To the point, my good pal Tommy Hamilton has got himself a whole bowl as well. He added extra honey just because he can and I can't. <laughs> but that, that, oh, that filler was ridiculous. Honestly, try it if you're hungry, dieting, whatever, but pff, just over 300 calories for that, amazing. This makes Day 148, still a spring in my step, good leg session, all's good, feeling good, ready to compete. Episode 148, 
Done. So today I made a little bit of a boo-boo.